vlogging my experience as a first year TRIPS leader. I'm Anna East. I am a Dartmouth 24 and I'm leading the organic farming trip this year. So how TRIPS is structured is that there are three days of programming. Um, it's been adjusted because of COVID. So um, the first day we got to go to the organic farm and um, we picked cherry tomatoes, harvested peppers, and also planted some spinach. Um, we did some bonding activities. We also got to pick these lovely flowers from the organic farm. And um, today is the second day. It's our Hanover day, which means we do some special activities on campus and we um, can sort of explore Dartmouth more. And on the third day, we are going to the ski lodge. Um, some other trips are going to Moose Lock Lodge. Um, and we have programming there. So I'll just be showing you my experience. Also, if you're interested in seeing more Dartmouth content, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Hello. We're on our way to Foco. is like as big as they'll get. They're just little guys. And then we've got some bigger pumpkins here. Um, and then coming with which is like the one you've probably seen a lot in grocery stores. It's the dark purple one. We also right with for like how long the yeah, yeah. prongs are kind of. Yeah. And then we'll go over this with um with some rakes and that'll sort of like even out the surface. Of, of these beds and then we can plant our spinach seeds. We'll just directly sow. Diana, what are you doing? <laughs> you gave up on jumping on the, the machine? I think we're gonna take turns. Oh, okay. Right yeah, now. I need to do jumping on the machine. Yeah, go for it. But first, I'm more invested. I'm picking cherry tomatoes. So <laughs> she can do. Yeah, as many as you can find. We need to get some. Eating. And eating them. Absolutely. 
tomatoes are so fresh and really sweet and we're just kind of like picking them and eating them as we go hmm the yellow ones are the best yeah we're so sweet and then they're tilling the soil back there we're getting ready to plant spinach Two kinds of kale. We just picked the cherry yeah. tomatoes here. Like this and these are all eggplants. And then That's we're harvesting the peppers stuff. right now. This is so beautiful. Guys, say hi to the vlog. Oh, hi vlog. Check out my peppers. Oh, they're so cute. They're so red. <laughs> <laughs> Trippies just had breakfast and now we are on the golf course. There's the Winter Activity Center. There's a bunch of trippies, 25s, 24s, 23s, 22s. And right now we just have some free time. So everyone put down their backpacks and we're playing frisbee and ball. Um, and right there, there, there's a big game of, uh, I have a Blitz 4, which is a game that you'll learn when you come to Dartmouth. And yeah, it's just a nice day outside today. are gonna be dipping their feet in the Connecticut River and enjoying the water. And some of our other trippies are going paddleboarding and swimming. And it's just gonna be wonderful. We're here at Ledyard. This is the Ledyard um, Clubhouse and you can rent canoes and kayaks and paddle boards for free. Um, and it is really popular during the summer and also early fall. There are trippies. to make some Annie's snack. Or Trangia. <laughs> yeah, I think I got it. Also, we have some tortillas and cheese and snacks and salsa. Cutting the bell peppers right now. Say hi. Hello. Uh -huh. Cutting peppers. <laughs> day three of trips um, and I basically just went into town 
It is one of my Trippies' birthday today. It's Samara's birthday. So I went and got her a fudge cupcake from Blue's and I also made a card that everyone's going to sign. So today we are getting focal breakfast at 9 a.m. and we'll probably hang around campus for a bit before um, getting picked up to go to the ski lodge for our final day. And traditionally trips does end with everyone going to the ski lodge. So I'm really glad that we got the best schedule and we can maintain some sense of normalcy for our trippies. So last night was really fun. We just cooked Annie's Mac and also made some quesadillas with bell peppers and cheese and salsa because they had some extra at the um, Dartmouth Outing Club headquarters. And so we had mac and cheese, um, we ate our corn nuts, which my trippies are obsessed with for some reason. And um, the 25 set a party under the stars. There's like Justin Bieber and Katy Perry songs dancing and there's a big mosh pit. Um, and the stars are simply stunning. Just like, <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it. It's otherworldly. How many stars you can see, the clarity. Um, and it's just like a dusting of powdered sugar across the sky. And I'm just always in awe of um, the view that you get of the galaxy from the Dartmouth um, golf course at night. I, I don't understand why. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> having fun up on the hill they're playing spike ball and they're throwing frisbees around and it's just been a really fun time there's also watercolor and like drawing and art in the ski lodge for people that want to do less intense activities but right now we're just enjoying nature and each other's company all right y'all something special is happening seven, eight, seven, 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 eight, seven, other surprises on the third day of trips that I didn't film because I want to still maintain the experience for incoming students and keep it somewhat of a secret so you just need to know that we had a wonderful last day of trips and truly it was a really special experience for me because um, the 24s didn't get trips at all it was completely canceled because of COVID so for me, not only was I able to welcome the 25s and introduce them to Dartmouth, but it was also sort of like a trips experience, first year trips experience for me as well. And I loved every moment of it. My trippies were so sweet and 
my co Diana was amazing um, and I really loved leading trips with her so that's the end of the vlog make sure to like comment and subscribe for more content and stay tuned for fun stuff to come <laughs>